in um, some of these things in our um, land, sea, and sky uh, work, I'm going to ask you to take a photo of the work that you do and then paste it into a uh, Google uh, slide. If you're not sure how to do that, there are a few different ways. If you're working on an iPad or a tablet, it's really easy. Just take the iPad or the tablet, take the photo, pop it straight in. If you're working on a laptop like I am, then it's going to be a little bit difficult because I'm going to have to get my phone and take a photo of my work and then get the photo from my phone into my Google slide, which is going to be a little bit tricky. So let's pretend that this is my work, okay? It's not very good work, but I'm going to take a photo of it with my phone. There we go. And then to get that from the phone to uh, into my um, uh, presentation, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the photo in the phone. Um, there it is. In fact, I've changed my mind. Shall we put a photo of one of my cats in there as well? Because it's exactly the same thing. So uh, let's put a photo of Amber. So let's pretend Amber is my work. And there she is. OK, so we want to get this photo from here into uh, my Google slide. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to hit the share button on the photo. And I've got the Gmail app on my phone, and that's linked to my Lana email address. So I'm going to choose to share it via Gmail, or I could open up Gmail and attach it to an email. And I'm just going to send it to myself. Now, if you are um, if you need to use mum or dad's phone, uh, make sure you ask them. And then you can uh, take a photo on their phone, and from their email, just email it to your Lana email address. So now I've just put in, can you see that? I'm sending this to myself. So Amber, off you go. Now that take, might take a couple of seconds to come through. So if I go into my email inbox, I can see I've got a email from Miss Heather. Very, very exciting. Um, I'm just going to keep refreshing that for a moment. Hopefully, this email is going to come through. Sometimes it takes a while from my phone because my phone is old and useless. I can see it's still stuck in the outbox. Come on, useless phone. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. Let's just pause the recording. Okay, awesome, so that has sent it through. I've got nothing in my outbox. Don't know if you can see that or not. It's probably backwards for you anyway. So now I'm gonna come into my computer and hopefully somewhere in the, in the up in cyberspace, that email is floating around and it's gonna make its way through to my computer. And there it is. So now here's Amber and I can get Amber. Now, how do I get it from here? into here. So let's say this is my work that I want to um, do. And um, how do I get that from here into here? So all I need to do is actually, can you see, I'm going to drag her with my mouse, uh, bring her up here, plop her there. Oh, it's failed. So if it fails, first thing you can do is get rid of that bit in the middle there. If it fails, then what you might need to do is click download. And it's going to download this photo onto my computer. So I'm going to just save it as Amber up on my desktop. There we go. And then I'm going to go to here. And I'm going to go to insert image, upload from computer. Going to search on my desktop for the photo that's called Amber. And in she goes. And then you can make that a little bit bigger. Now, if you want to make this a bit bigger, you can always delete some of the extra bits off here if you want to um, so that your work can be a little bit bigger. So that's how we get a photo of our work into our slideshow. Remember, this slideshow, you're going to submit it to me at the end of the week with your finished work. OK, guys? All right. Hope that was clear. Uh, any problems, just drop me an email. All right. See you later, guys.